and welcome dudes and dudettes. This is of course Lightlager here and today I'm gonna be doing a sponsored tutorial on this Tron dApp known as Tron Sender which is basically a tool for distributing Tron TRC10 and TRC20 tokens into multiple addresses by using CSV files and TXT files. And this is basically a clone version of the Multisend dApp on the Ethereum side, which we did a video not too long ago. So I'm gonna be showing you basically how to use it. The first thing you obviously need is to log in uh, with your Tron link address and choosing obviously the right uh, mainnet here. We're gonna be doing the test on actual testnet. And obviously that is the best way to do it because you wanna try it out and see it actually works and does everything as you have told it to do. And the first thing you're obviously gonna be doing after logging in, you're gonna be choosing the token that you're gonna be distributing. Uh, the Tron one is always gonna be on top and the actual address field is actually blank. Um, and then there's obviously, you can see the TRC10 tokens don't have a contract address. They have this sort of a n uh, number thing here instead. So that's how you can kind of like, you know, identify between TRC10 and TRC20. So I'm gonna be choosing TRX and then this one will be automatically draining the decimals for every token and currency being supported here. And after that, I can upload a CSV. I can also just paste here in the field everything that I have. Um, but if you just like add something wrong here, uh, the actual application will tell you, oh, you got something invalid here. Like we have maybe like an extra line here, which is empty or there's a duplicate address on two of the lines, kind of useful stuff. And the actual transaction is gonna be costing around 500 TRX plus the actual gas fees attached to that. And after you have like detailed all the information here, obviously first comes the address, then comes the, um, the hyphen, and then the number of tokens are that are being sent to each address. I can send this person 50 Tron and this one I can send 180 Tron for instance, but now I'm going to be actually swapping back into Shasta mainnet um, Testnet sorry, and I'm going to be doing the test there because I can it's going to be cheap and Basically the process is 100% mirrored between the two So when you're going to be doing the process on here and there it's going to be pretty much the same I'm going to be using uh, this uh, cheat sheet that I have cleared out here and we're gonna be selecting token, it's gonna be Tron. Now that I'm on testnet, I don't have any other tokens on my testnet account. So it's not actually showing me tokens that I, I don't own. Now let's click approve and send. And here it's gonna be saying the total number of addresses we are sending in how many transaction this is gonna be taking. And this is telling me how much TRX I have and the cost of operation, which is 500 TRX and network fees and the total number of tokens being sent of those three addresses combined. And the token balance here once again. So we're gonna be clicking next, and then there's gonna be actual acceptance. And now the transaction will be confirmed and it's been sent into all of those three addresses which were added here uh, just a minute ago. And it will probably take a couple of seconds until it will actually show you on TransScan the actual transfer. And here you can see that there are uh, addresses that have received some money. So uh, here goes the actual payment into um, the, the merchant service and there's some type of an affiliate fee there. And then there are three transactions which happen basically, which we were the addresses we add earlier to get and receive 100 TRX. Right now the consume energy is around 41,000 TRX. So basically, um, you're gonna be reading if you don't have any energy stake that means you're gonna be paying 6 TRX plus the 500 to get the transaction go through as uh, for all the other information you can find all the social media links on the top and you can discuss with the team and everything about regarding the project I'm also gonna linking in the corner the ethereum version of this actual contract in case you're interested in doing uh, these types of multi things. And these are kind of used for, you know, paying your employees or 
paying people who have been uh, participating on job or airdrops obviously is the most common one and there are many other utilities that this can basically be done but this is ultimately going to be much more cheaper than doing one by one transactions so understand that, that the multi-send tool will always become more affordable in terms of the gas fees uh, in order to send the transactions in one just you know transaction thanks for watching i will be seeing you guys on the next video if you have any questions leave them down below or into the actual social media links listed down in the description thanks for watching see you soon